how to set up apps on workforce pro wf4830 open the browser in your pc and search for this website which is appson.com you will find this website where you just need to scroll down and here you need to select the reason so i'm going to select usa just click on it now the home page will open where you need to hover on support and click on printers you will find printer support page just scroll down and here you need to select printer type so it will fall under all in ones so just click on it and now we need to select printer series so it is workforce series click on it and in last step we need to select printer model name and here I have selected I'm going to click on it and the finally printer page will open where you can see its name and image and the model number here so you need to scroll down and here you will find the downloads tab and under downloads tab you will see the running operating system on your PC you can change it manually as well and the recommended drivers for your printer so this is recommended driver its name is drivers and utilities combo package installer you can click on any driver name and you will find all detail about that like you can see the release date file size and file name and now you can see description and compatible systems so this is a driver through which we are going to complete the setup so I'm going to download it by clicking on download button it will start downloading here as you can see and once it will complete we need to launch it by clicking on this arrow icon and click on open once you launch it then it will prompt a window and ask your permission to make changes to your device click on yes and later this window will appear to you so here you need to click on ok to continue now file is extracting let's wait and the software is launched you can see its appearance and here we need to accept license agreement click on accept now it is taking system requirement click on next make sure your printer is powered on and then click on next now it is downloading required software and now we need to select connection type like Wi-Fi or USB cable or Ethernet cable so I'm going to select Wi-Fi and then click on next let's wait here in next step you need to make sure your printer is powered on and any appear on your printer control panel you need to check that and perform that and click on next and you need to follow these instructions on your printer control panel you need to follow the same and proceed with next button so this way you can follow on screen instructions to complete the setup of your apps and printer so I hope this video was helpful to you if you want any further help you can call us on the given number in this video description or click on the support link